They have been working thanklessly for decades and here in the streets of Lahore are protesting for their rights. These are the representatives of the labor class of Pakistan. They are approximately 54.92 million and these include the farmers from Okara who protested at the Lahore's Workers' Party rally not against the brutality of the feudal lords but the military. بارہ سال قبل انہوں نے مزارین کو وہاں سے استحصالی نظام جو اٹھے کہ دینے نظام لاغو کر کے ان کو بدخل کرنے کی کوشش کی اور جس کے نتیجے میں وہاں پہ تحریک کا آغاز ہوا یاور زمان ہے وہ امپیا ہے ہمارے علکے کا میاں یاور زمان مسلم لی نون کا ہے اس نے کبھی تاکہ ہماری امیت میں کبھی کوئی بیان ہی نہیں دیا وہ ہے کہ جاگیردار آدمی ہے اور جتنے بھی جاگیردار ہیں سرمایہ دار ہیں یہ سب جو ہمارے گریبوں کے حقوق کے خلاف ہیں These military farms were handed over to the army during partition but farmers have been fighting for their rights as tenants since 2001 Mohammad Shahzad Shafi came with his fellow villagers from Okara members of a peasants movement which began agitating for their right to cultivate and own the military farm land in his village of Chak 25 by 4L soldiers of the 42 brigade continue to bully the farmers ये 12 मार्च को तकरीबन साढ़े आठ बजे सुबह बतालीस ब्रिगेड के फौजी जवान और अफसर सिविल कपड़ों में चाक नंबर पच्चीस फोरल पर उधर मरबा नंबर सताईस में आए हैं उधर हमारे मज़ारे पानी लगा रहे थे उन्होंने कहा कि आप पानी हम आपको नहीं लगाने देंगे उन्होंने कहा भी हमारी बारी है पानी की उन्होंने कहा नहीं पानी हम लेकर जाएंगे अपने रकबे पर उधर से इनका झगड़ा हुआ है इन्होंने मज़ारी इनको मारा है और उनका ताकब करते हुए ये गांव के बिल्कुल करीब आ गए हैं गांव से चार कनाल दूर सिर्फ उधर आकर हमारी औरतों को बकायदा एक फौजी जब वो नंगा हुआ है उन्होंने मारा है औरतों की बेहरमती की है इससे हमारे आठ अफराज जो मुश्तिद जख्मी हुए हैं Shafiq and his fellow protesters have been paying lease money to military regularly. But after this incident, their voices are snubbed and false cases have been registered against him and other peasants. The most important thing is that after all this work, they have also been in the fight for me. When I was in the fight for the other people, they have been in the fight for the other people. More than 20 villages in Punjab with an approximate population of 1 million have been farming on this land. Other protesters at the rally vowed to continue their resistance for the rights of the worker. Some came to appeal to those in higher echelons of power to listen to their cases. The labor force makes up for a large percentage of working Pakistani population, but their struggle has been unheard over decades. The instability in economy, growing population and inflation has added to the poverty of the working classes but the marginalized classes and the parties fighting for them are never elected Asim Sajad Akhtar a political economist and office bearer of the Workers Party Pakistan explains why well I mean frankly as is now becoming clear the biggest culprit in manipulating the electoral processes are our own intelligence agencies so let's just not make it about political parties and about the election commission. Let's make it about the most sacred institution of them all. Um, so the rot starts from the top. Um, and until the very principle of the people's right to choose their leadership is enshrined uh, in certain practices and it is outlawed for any institution, whether it be a military one or any other, to interfere or to or take away that right, we will continue to have flawed electoral processes. Till transparency is established in the institutions, be it the matter of land reforms or paying minimum wages to the labor force, the grievances of the peasants like Muhammad Shahzad Shafiq will remain unheard. This is Rabia Mahmood for Express Tribune in Lahore.